right welcome to my channel and welcome to another edition of video update on lagos calabar coastal highway this section of calabar coastal highway is actually hidden for many maybe you have been seeing a lot of calabar coastal highway the one at um eco atlantic from amadu Bello way you have seen the one eleko inside but this section of calabar coastal highway is hidden and that is why we are here to give you latest current update and development in lagos calabar coastal highway i'd like you to watch the video to the end i'm going to show you maybe let's see the drone view of this calabar coastal highway to see the 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 intensity of the work that is currently going on in lagos calabar Gosa highway don't go we shall be right back Right. welcome back so you are seeing the, the 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 temple of the lagos calabar coastal highway in fact if you come here you will know that government is not playing and you will also know that the minister for work david omai is not also playing we have had a lot a lot of controversial issue on the lagos calabar coastal highway some says that legal uh, government is actually wasting money some say that the coastal highway is not needed some say they are using it to siphon or to do corruption but the truth of the matter is whether you do well or you don't do well people will still talk the lagos calabar coastal highway who is going to benefit from it is the whole world i can tell you nigeria is going to benefit from it um real estate company is going to benefit from it everybody is going to benefit from it i'm sure when you see something like this there will always be a resistance for example when the new name brought atm to nigeria there is a lot of resistance <laughs> when when they said okay we are going on cashless there is a lot of resistance so everything good there will always be a resistance. So whatever we are seeing right now on air about wasting money on Lagos Calabar Coastal Highway, I'm not surprised. But the goal of it all is going to benefit everybody. This is more even better. As you are seeing where I am standing, this section now goes down to Ondo State. This is Magbon Town of the lagos calabar coastal highway after a lack of inside so this is magbon town and from this road right now you can see the level of the sand filling that is going on 
and this place i'm standing is where the level is going to take there is another one ahead so this one you are seeing ahead they are going to take this level so all of this place will be some few to the level of this section this level and you can see the work can you imagine how many how many tippers how many trips of sand that have entered into this place so government is not playing in fact if this is only we are going to benefit from this government i can tell you it's worth it once they finish this coastal road nigerian economy when it comes to transportation can never be the same this is one of the largest coastal road in west africa and we should give kudos to the government for you know the government of Bola Ahmed Tinubu, a lot of presidents have come and you know they don't want to embark on it, but it takes the first step to start this coastal road, and I want to give it to him. This is one of his projects, and we believe that we believe that before you know he leave the office, the coastal highway from Lagos to Calabar is going to be completed so we wish him best of luck as this coastal road is going on right now and remember welcome to peak palm estate like i said is facing the lagos calabar coastal highway and this is magbon town right here in eleko inside if you don't know we have two eleko we have eleko on the lucky Ekpe expressway and we have the one inside eleko roundabout so the eleko inside is where the coastal road is passing from vi down to this place once we are done with the coastal road is around 30 minutes drive. that means that means you can drive from vi to this place 30 minutes and you are where according to uh minister for work david my the first phase of lagos calabar coastal highway will soon be officially launched and from um kilometer is zero to kilometer 48 which is going to end at abram adis soya ogombo area they are going to open it for motorists so and from that place to this place is around 15 minute drive now this is a good location that you can buy we want to say thank you to the minister of work the man is accountable and he knows what he's doing and thank you to the president of the federal republic of nigeria in person of bola ahmed tinobu so enjoy the rest of the video of the lagos calabar coastal highway right here you can see this you can see this massive work massive work going on here massive work going on here on the lagos calabar coastal highway thank you for staying to the end of the video remember to turn on the notification bell so that you can get new updates on lagos calabar coastal highway till i come your way next time god bless you and bye for now